question a lot lately, and it's how can I optimize my relationship with the PR agency or digital media agency that I've hired to help build brand awareness? So I'm going to give you my best tips. I've owned my own agency and I've also worked at many agencies. And I'm going to give you a behind the scenes look um, and, and some, some of their pain points as well as some of the things you can do to be really easy to work with. And the first thing that I want to um, tip I want to give you is you need to really know your business. So the best thing you could do upon introducing yourself to your agency is gather everybody in the agency that's going to be working on your account and create a presentation just for them. The presentation doesn't need to be any more than 10 pages long in PowerPoint or Keynote. And it can be um, you know, very visual, doesn't have a, lot, have a lot of copy and explanation, but you want to include some key things in this presentation. And you want to knock them dead. You want to blow them away the minute you meet the team that you're going to be working with. So they know how serious you are and how well you know your business and what you expect from them. The first thing you want to include is a, a product description, service descriptions, what it is that you've created that is so phenomenal that they are going to promote. You're also going to want to bring them samples so they can try it. This is your first meeting with your PR agency. The second slide or photo or image in this presentation is going to be your marketing competition. The third is where you're going to want them to bring you. What collaborations do you want? What influencers do you want to connect with? What media outlets do you hope to get feature stories and product reviews in? You also want to give them an example of where you're going, what stores you're going to be in, what online channels, and how fast you plan on growing. You want to know, let them know who to connect with at your company. It might just be you. You might be just a solo entrepreneur right now, or it might be a team. But how it is that you will be able to communicate with them on a weekly basis. So that's some of the things that you're going to want to give them right up front. Now, when it comes to working with the agency, you also want to make sure that you make yourself available to them for interviews, for requests they need. And if you heed their advice, if they need something like better high resolution photos, or maybe better content um, for your blog, or maybe something special for your digital media kit, you need to listen to their advice. You hired a professional agency. I'm sure you went through a great interview process. So do as they ask. They are giving you directives. And uh, if you don't, then you're going to make the, the relationship um, not as effective. The next thing that you want to do is, I pray to God you didn't lowball the fee. Because although very much you want to work with either the founder or a seasoned account executive at the agency, um, You'll end up with an intern or an assistant if your fee does not help pay their rent and their salaries because at the end of the day, that agency is scrambling to cover their overhead, make a little money, and also service the squeakiest wheels of the clients that are just calling every day. So you want to make sure that you pay them a fee that they can actually do the work for and that you are there to help uh, collaborate with them and communicate effectively and you give them what you need and you let them know you know what your business is all about. Now the last thing I'm going to give you as a tip is you want to make sure that the expectations for media coverage and collaboration is realistic. I have had many clients come to me with stars in their eyes and they're just thinking I'm going to get them on the cover of People magazine, which would be a completely unrealistic thing for most brands unless you were a huge celebrity. So be realistic about what this agency can actually do for you and more importantly, what collaborations are going to bring you the best return on investment. So you may bring to them where you want to be, but listen and understand where they think you should be. If you have any other questions about media relations, collaborations, or how to effectively work with an agency or a media relations specialist, write below in the comment section or hit me up on Twitter at Market Council. I'd love to hear from you. Thank you so much for watching.